coverage you can count on. This is KCBD News Channel 11 at 10. And good evening. Thank you so much for joining us. Karen and Abner are off tonight. We begin with our tournament coverage, which unfortunately includes a loss for Texas Tech. Number one Houston defeated the Red Raiders 82 to 59 in the Big 12 semifinals tonight. Pete Christie joins us live from Kansas City with a reaction from Coach McCaslin. Pete. Yeah, guys, uh, the Red Raiders put up a fight, not only, the, uh, not only the number one team in the conference, the number one team in the nation. Tech fell behind by 16, but battled all the way back to tie it early in the second half. And then Houston went on a 33-6 run to blow the doors open. But the Red Raiders were really uh, undermanned tonight. They uh, obviously didn't have Warren Washington again. And Darian Williams wanted to go. He just couldn't get out there. Uh, and so they were really short staff tonight but they battled showed the fight of a fearless champion and afterwards coach McCaslin talked about seeing these guys do all they could despite being undermanned for our team to finish games and we haven't been able to finish either game we've gotten close for 25 minutes for 20 minutes and that's where the physicality and the ability to, to fight and compete with depth is so important against them. And if there's anything I'll tell you is we've got the right guys. We just need to add a couple more that are healthy so that we can finish this game. And I like our game plan. I like our competitiveness. I didn't do a good enough job when we went with that smaller lineup of giving us a way to score with the rate that they were scoring at. And now the Red Raiders will find out where they're going in the uh, March Madness of the NCAA tournament. The USA is open Sunday to the public, four to six. Coach McCaslin said, come out and celebrate with these guys. They are pumped to be in the big dance, and we'll see what they can do. Wrapping it up here in Kansas City with the Red Raiders, Pete Christie will send it back to you. Okay, thank you so much, Pete.